Yes. The number of university students in Korea who plan to retake the college entrance exam, or Sunung, this year is expected to reach an all-time high of 90,000. 올해 대학 수학 능력 시험 수능 응시자 중 대학에 다니다가 재수하는 일명 반수생의 수가 역대 최고치인 9만 명에 육박할 것으로 보입니다. Yes. Wow, so many 반수생. Yes, exactly. Um, but uh, at least it's not complete 재수생 or um, mm. they're uh, retaking the test after having completed one semester. Yeah. Um, or just um, some of them will still be enrolled in mm. their current universities. But according to a Suning Academy, uh, the number of Uh, university students currently applying to retake the 2024 college entrance exam. To be exact, is expected to be 89,642, the highest number since uh, the Suning uh, released mock exam statistics in 2011, or the Korea Curriculum Evaluation Service released their statistics mm. back in 2011. This is really interesting because the overall number of students taking the Suning is going down every year. Yes, that's right. The population of the younger generation is going down, and yet the number of university students mm-hmm. who are going to retake the Suning this year has gone up. That's right. Why? Um, So it is because of the amended rules and the um, expanded uh, allowance for medical uh, Mm. students uh, or medical school students. And so even those uh, students who are enrolled in um, the good universities, um, they are taking another shot at medical school. Right. It's the popularity of these medical schools and the prospects of becoming a doctor, I suppose, that are getting even more maybe popular or uh, maybe, I'm not exactly sure if it's the most popular, but, Mm -hmm. uh, you know, it's definitely something that students are thinking, you know, it's worth taking another shot, it's worth taking the exam again for. Mm. And uh, another reason why is uh, some are attributing the surge of the retakers Uh, to the elimination of some killer questions Mm. from the exam starting this year. So some uh, students who believe that they did not get um, better scores because of these killer questions, Mm. uh, they're going to be aiming for higher scores Uh, next year. uh, 킬러 문항이 어, 점차 줄어들 것으로 예상을 하고 있기 때문에 Mm -hmm. 그러면 은 다시 내가 시험을 봐서 특히 이제 의대를 목표로 하고 있는 그런 Mm -hmm. 지금 재학 중이거나 재학을 했다가 지금 잠시 쉬면서 하는 반수생들이 참 많이 늘어났다라는 얘기가 되겠습니다. Mm-hmm. 다시 시험을 보는 것을 영어로는 retaking the exam이라고 하죠. That's right. So if you take a test, yeah. um, you're uh, going to a certain location and you're taking a test. If you're yeah. retaking that test, you've taken it before, yeah. but you're going to take it again. It's confusing because in Korean we say 시험을 보다, mm-hmm. but in English... Take a test. Exactly. You you take it. You never <laughs> see it. No, you never see it. If you just see it, you don't actually take it. <laughs> you just look over it. Yeah. 네, 우리말로 시험을 보다 아니면 시험을 치다 라고 하는 거 영어로는 take an exam이라고 mm-hmm. 합니다. 자, 그 다음에 this is an all-time high. That's right. It means that you've hit a record. Mm. Um, it's one of the highest numbers that we have hit. So it, uh, looking back in history, um, it has never been this high before. Right. Mm. An all-time high, 사상 최고치가 되겠습니다. 자, 다시 한번 읽어볼게요. The number of university students in Korea who plan to retake the college entrance exam or 수능 this year is expected to reach an all-time high of 90,000. Let's move on to the next headline.